Hello, and welcome to Kubernetes A to Z course. I am Ryan, your host for the course, and this course is mainly taught by Mr. AJ. At first, I'm giving a little bit introduction about Mr. AJ. He worked as an IT solutions architect and specializes in cloud, automation, and DevOps. Over a decade, he served several companies like IBM, TCS, and Adobe. AJ also is a corporate trainer and trained thousands of developers and engineers over the globe. He also writes Kubernetes for Absolute Beginners and DevOps 123 books to help the students who want to move forward in DevOps. This course is divided into five chapters. At the first chapter, we cover all the fundamentals and refreshing knowledge like Docker fundamentals, virtual machine, Docker hub, Kubernetes architecture, and a basic YAML introduction. The second chapter, we will set up the development environment, configure master controller and minions. We also give a glimpse on pod, cube admin, and cube CTL. In the third chapter, we will do a lot of practice with Docker. The fourth chapter is all about POD, tags, and services. At first, we will set up Google Kubernetes engine. Then, we will create a cluster on it. Then we cover namespace, application deployment, application expose, scale in, scale out, levels, selectors, and a lot of other things hands-on step by step. Our last chapter is all about storage management on Kubernetes. In this chapter, we will cover a hands-on project using Kubernetes on Google Cloud Engine. Now, the questions come what you will get from the course. After this course, you will be able to understand, administer, and deploy Kubernetes, able to deploy Kubernetes clusters, get solid foundation with containerization and run containers on Kubernetes, be able to run stateless and stateful applications on Kubernetes, be able to deploy MySQL on WordPress on Kubernetes.